actually did another DJ's Brew 2 Mix Drink How To. That's right, the hard liquor's out and the delicious ingredients too. You know what? The night is over, but my job is not complete. Why? Because I have not made the missus her delicious cocktail. And what delicious cocktail am I going to prepare for her today? Well, since she's partial to Crown Royal, I'm going to make a Crown Royal sidecar. That's right. This uh, drink's got four, maybe five ingredients if you count the ice and sugar that we're using for a rimmer. We, we got Crown Royal, we got Triple Sec, and we've got Sweet and Sour Mix. Boom, boom, boom. Sweet, sour, balanced, booze. It's, it's just how it works. So... Let's get to making this drink. So first off, we've got the Crown Rooney that we're gonna put into our ice-filled shaker here. We've got an ounce and a quarter of Crown today. Boom, into the glass it goes. Now we've got a quarter ounce of triple sec. Bam, got that nice orange flavor going on. And we have two ounces of homemade sweet and sour mix. And of course, as I always, I always have the recipe in the notes section and I'll have the recipe for the sweet and sour mix just in case you don't know how to make that. You can buy sweet and sour mix, but I'm telling you guys, it just does not taste the same. So we've got all the ingredients in our tin that's filled with ice. Ah, now it's time for my favorite part probably of making drinks and that's getting the shake face on and getting happy about making someone a lovely smelling and tasting drink. Let's get it on. Ah, <laughs> yeah. We're gonna go for about a 10 count. Boom, all done. Now we've got our coupe glass here that we've put a lovely rim of gorgeous sugar around. So this is kind of like a play sort of on a margarita in some way. You've got the sweet and sour going on in there and you've got the, you know, the, the orange like you would put into a margarita but instead of tequila, we're gonna use Crown Royal on this one. So, got our top popped here and we're gonna strain this right down the center into our coupe glass. Yeah, look at that guys. Even looks kind of like a margarita, kind of that color. That's if you have one on the rocks or one that's been shaking the strain, not that frozen thing. So let's get a taste of this. Look at that though, guys, before I get into the taste part. Just delicious in that gorgeous little cocktail glass with that, like it looks like it looks like uh, like it's frozen up at the top with that, uh, that uh, rimmer of sugar, just gorgeous. So let's get a taste on this bad boy. Wow. That is super balanced, man. The orange is in there. You got the little bit of like the rye and the smokiness going on the whiskey to balance out that. You have the sweetness that's coming from the sweet and sour mix and also sweetness coming from the triple sec, but that's balanced off by the, um, <clears throat> excuse me, that's balanced off by the, uh, you know, sort of sour that's going on in the sweet and sour mix. So, you know, if we make, want to make it look extra pretty, boom, we'll put a little lime on there and look at that guys there you have it the crown royal sidecar so as you can see easy as one two three to make make this for somebody you care about or for yourself and i promise that either they or you will have a smile on your face something that also puts a smile on my face is when you think globally drink locally and support the craft cocktail and craft beer movement because that along with copious amounts of Crown Royal Sidecars puts my happy face on. So, to the next DJ's Brew Tube, please remember to rate, comment, subscribe if you haven't already subbed up. Every week, if I can, we put out a lovely mixed drink video. Ah, and after you're done doing that, remember, smash that like button. So, to the next DJ's Brew Tube, I got nothing but a bunch of Crown Royal Sidecar maybe sipping and serving love coming for you. And you know what's that? Well, you know what's that? That's right. Peace.